Dr. Kate Strathbin, thank you so much for being here today. As you know, um, you're here to have a look at a dress which has recently very kindly been donated to the Fashion Museum um, by Anne Green. And um, we're very excited about it and very much hoping that you can help us verify that it once belonged to Queen Alexandra. Fantastic, it's very exciting. I can't wait to see it. <laughs> Let's take a look. I can't um, wait. see it's a really fabulous colour. It is totally vibrant. It's much brighter than I thought it was going to be actually. Um, yeah and those tones of half mourning that suited her stage of life at that point. And I don't know what you thought Kate but I thought the, the fact that it's got this wonderful bobbin lace mm. which is clearly um, an expensive commission mm. um, I thought that really tied in well with the idea of this being um, a royal piece. It does. So I suppose we've got quite a lot of compelling evidence really. Mm. Um, we have the strong links with the donor's family and their connection with the royal household. We have the, the maker who we know was um, being commissioned to create pieces again for members of, of the yes. royal household. Um, we have the choice mm. of colour, fabrics, the lace. Mm. And then finally, we have the measurements, and that is both the, the measurement of the waistband and, interestingly, that slight discrepancy with the size of the boning yes. in the bodice. Yes. So all of those things are add up to something that tells that story, which, is, which sometimes is only the only way that you can get to these details is through dress. Uh, the measurements, which is really interesting because that's the only way that we can sometimes identify that kind of material. It is almost like a fingerprint that you can that identify a body through the clothes that are left. And it's so distinctive with her that she did with the increase of her scoliosis as she got older, that it changes the shape of the way her clothes are made on one side. And so seeing that in this garment is, is particularly compelling, I think. Fantastic. So having seen the dress today, um, what are your thoughts? I think, I think definitely when you pull all of those things together that are individually interesting but together make something that is much more of a complete picture, I, I think you can say very, you know, with quite a strong degree of certainty that it, that it would have been Queen Alexandra, so it's fantastic. <laughs>